welcome to getting clean on the prairies i am just getting things set up here so i can start uh, my cucumbers indoors so for planting my cucumbers i am going to try using these biodegradable paper cups that i cut holes in the bottom of um, and i'm hoping that i can just plant them up in these cups and they'll go right from here to to my garden in about um, in about six weeks i think month to six weeks we're at the uh, third week of april um, so yeah i guess we're about five or six weeks away from last frost and um, we'll see what the weather's like by mid-june and if these are ready to go out into the garden so uh, like my um, tomato planting i'm trying to keep myself limited on how many cucumbers I start and uh, how many varieties that I'm going to be trying this year. So I've narrowed it down to just five, um, five different kinds of, of uh, pep, five different kinds of cucumbers. And I'm going to just do up two containers with each two seeds in each so that just in case some of them don't uh, germinate and from there we'll see how many we have to go into the garden so as i mentioned i have uh, five different types of cucumbers i'm going to try growing and the first one is a perseus hybrid cucumber so this is a self-pollinating cucumber i think it's similar to um, like an english type cucumber so you can eat the the peeling or the skin as well so we'll try that straight eight this is a standard cucumber that grows well here all the time i like to grow them every year they're a good slicing cucumber tastes great all the time in salads um, the national pickling if I decide I'm going to do pickles, um, these are supposed to be good for that. You can pick them when they're a small size and they're good for pickling, but also good just to eat fresh as well. Um, this is one that I've purchased locally from uh, Blazing Star a Company. You see, I buy a lot of my seeds from, and this is the, the uh, lemon cucumber. I tried the cucumel in last uh, summer and it kind of got um, choked out by my other cucumbers. So going to give it another try and grow it separately I think in a in its own pot so try that and then this is another one that I received through the Canadian seed exchange challenge it's called a yellow apple cucumber and I received that from a, a fellow gardener in Toronto so I'm going to try those very interested to see what those turn out like Okay, so I thought as part of my uh, winter sowing versus indoor growing challenge that uh, maybe a good uh, fun test here would, to, would be to try planting some of these cucumber seeds in the winter sowing jugs as well. Um, sticking them outside. These will be planted the same time as the ones that I've started indoors, just a couple days apart, and uh, see how this goes. Um, Cucumbers are not very um, cold tolerant plants and they do like a warm soil temperature and um, need that warm temperature to germinate. So it'll be interesting to see whether they can uh, germinate in a winter sowing jug. So I'm gonna just plant two of the kinds that I'm planting in my indoors grows, growing and that is the straight eight and the, the Perseus. So I was filming my planting of the cucumber seeds indoors and I mustn't have had the record button going because um, I didn't capture that planting, but um, it's pretty straightforward. I think most people know how to plant seeds. I don't need to show you, but I'm just gonna set these on top. I'm gonna put four in here. These ones have a coating on them, the Perseus ones. Pretty blue color. Thank you. 
And then I just press them down about a half inch to the soil with this pen. Soil is well moistened. Just cover it up, press it down, and we will tape that up. So I've moistened this soil from the top and also set it in a tray here with a bunch of water to let it wick up so it's it's good and heavy, it's very moist, and it is quite likely, because the temperatures here are still very cold, they're still predicting some freezing temperatures of about minus 8 to minus 10 degrees Celsius. So uh, it's quite likely that this is going to freeze. Not sure what's going to happen, so it'll be interesting to see. Okay, so we're just going to take these cucumbers out to the uh, winter sowing jug patch out here, add them to the group. I've been using straw only here as their insulation. I haven't been covering them up at night, taking them indoors. and. Uh, We'll see how they do. I have peeked at a few of these. They still have green sprouts. Nothing too big yet. I forgot to write on the outside, but I do have them marked on the inside, so. So needless to say, so far the indoor growing is uh, way ahead of the uh, winter sowing jugs, but I see this kind of as a tortoise and the hare kind of race. Those indoor plants have a really nice warm environment and a perfect growing situation and they are just flying along but but these jugs out here they have a much colder harsher environment so they are moving along much slower. Um, hopefully though at the end of the race they will come out um, tougher and stronger and maybe do better in the garden at the end of the day. So if you want to keep watching and find out how my winter sowing versus indoor growing challenge goes, please don't forget to hit subscribe, leave a comment and click on the notification bell so that you don't miss out on the next video.